Leaders from Garissa over the weekend convened a consultative conference for peace, security and countering violent extremism and came up with a raft of measures to fight terrorism. The measures include arming the local administrators like chiefs and providing them with at least 10 police officers. The meeting also proposed that special forces be deployed to terror-prone areas as opposed to the current arrangement where police officers without specialized training are deployed and the Kenya Defense Forces be deployed to man the border. The government was also urged to avoid extrajudicial killings and forced disappearance and also treat volunteers of information with utmost secrecy. The government was also urged to avoid extrajudicial killings and forced disappearance and also treat volunteers of information with utmost secrecy to avoid victimization. Others included the upgrading of all roads to bitumen standards to avoid the planting of improvised explosive devices that have claimed the lives of 653 officers in a span of three years. The committee that is charged with collecting the views will then share the same with the National Security for action and implementation. The forum was attended by current and former political leaders as well as senior security officers. The meeting was prompted by the latest terror attack in Kamude and Saredo primary schools in Dadaab and Fafi sub-counties respectively, where three teachers and four pupils were killed by Al-Shabaab militants.